Hi everyone, welcome back to another thing you know. A few days back, I met with a couple of friends at their place at night, ending up playing games, cycling a bit, and eventually coming back home at 7 in the morning. I came back, slept for about 4 hours, and was back to my routine, which is unusual as I sleep at least 8 to 9 hours every day. This got me thinking on how much sleep do we really need to function properly and be productive? Can we really survive with only 3-4 to hours of sleep? Turns out, there is a big difference between the amount of sleep you can get by and the amount you need to function optimally. Sleep requirements vary person to person, but most healthy adults need between 7-9 to hours of sleep per night to function at their best. This amount increases the younger you are. For teenagers, it is 8-10 to hours and newborns need 14-17 to hours of sleep. It is also not just about the number of hours. Quality of sleep is equally important. If you are sleeping for multiple hours but are not staying alert during the day, it probably means that you're not sleeping properly. Or in other words, you're getting less amount of deep sleep, the time required by the body to build up energy for the next day. While most of us do need the recommended 7-9 to nine hours of sleep every night, there are about 1-3% to of the human population for whom this amount of sleep is pure luxury. This group requires only about 3-5 to five hours of sleep and are known as sleep elites or night owls. While it is not clear on the reason why this group can function on such less amount of sleep, most scientists argue if they are at their best productivity during the day with this amount of sleep. Sleeping less might be working for the small group of individuals, but for the majority of us, sleep deprivation should be a big concern. While an occasional night without sleep makes you feel tired and irritable the next day, it won't harm your health. Continue this for several nights and it will become more serious. Not only will concentration levels go down, you will also be prone to serious medical conditions such as obesity, heart disease, high blood pressure and diabetes. Now you might be wondering after this, what is that magic number for you? The number that will allow you to be at your best while making sure you're not on the bed for a long time. This number differs for each individual, but the National Sleep Foundation recommends different sleeping hours based on age. The best way to figure out if you're meeting your sleep needs is to evaluate how you feel as you go about your day. If you're logging enough sleep hours, you'll feel energetic and alert all day long, from the moment you wake up until your regular bedtime. While I hope this was something new that you learned, And if you did, a like or a sub would be much appreciated. Thanks for watching as always. Until next time, take care.